Hi, my name is Martin Bailey and I'm CTO at Global Graphics Software, where I spend most of my time managing the Harlequin rep. We've just rolled out version 12.1 of Harlequin and I'm very proud to be here today to tell you what's new in this release. For those of you working in labels and packaging, the biggest news is that we're now supporting PDF processing steps. That's ISO 19593 for those who follow standards. And what it means is that you can tell Harlequin to just print structural marks and nothing else to run a few lead-in copies of your forms to check the registration of your inline and nearline finishing equipment. And then you can configure it to just print the live graphics and the legend for the bulk of the print job. There have been ways to do that for a while, but with processing steps, you can avoid the need to manually examine the file to figure out what names the creator used for technical separations and then to copy those into the configuration. Avoiding that manual step increases efficiency and removes an opportunity for errors. PDFs with processing steps can already be made with software from companies like Hybrid, ESCO and Callus. If you're in wide format, we're expecting processing steps to be useful here as well. And we've also added native support for BMP into Harlequin alongside PDF, Postscript, EPS, TIFF, JPEG, etc. In different market, if you're rendering for Flexo sleeves or non-publication Previewer, you'll be interested to know that we now support seamless screening. This is used to prevent zip line artifacts in the half toning where the raster wraps around the cylinder for very long graphics or for labels with staggered in position, etc. And for people driving high-speed digital presses, you'll already know that Harlequin is the fastest rib in the world. And in 12.1, we've expanded our integration framework to make it much easier to scale that performance from a single rip for a light production digital printer, all the way up to using multiple rips across multiple servers to drive presses that consume tens of gigabytes of raster data per second. You can tell we're an engineering company when I tell you we've named it the Harlequin Scalable Rip. It does what it says on the can. As always, there are lots of minor improvements to make Harlequin even more efficient and even faster. You can find more information on Harlequin, including what's new in version 12.1, at globalgraphics.com slash harlequin. Or drop a line to info at globalgraphics.com to talk to somebody about evaluating Harlequin for your next digital press. Thanks for listening.